What's up guys, it's Navi Steven here, and here is the final map in the new DLC map pack. This is Stockpile, and I am doing my final review on it. As you've seen in the past videos, I did a review on all the newest ones. Convoy, Hotel, Zoo, and uh, I feel like I'm forgetting one. Maybe I'm not though. But uh, yeah, so this is the final map in the map pack and uh something about convoy is uh if you were ever as a little kid and you played uh like king of the hill hold the fort something like that um this map is uh going to relate to it really good as you can see you know you're kind of in a uh industrial part of town or wherever it is um or just the buildings are really run down but uh, right here is the main building this is the main part of the whole entire map and that is because this is the center of the map it's the warehouse and because it also has this ability which as you can see here in the bunt the doors are shutting and it locks the enemy out now the only thing about this is uh that they can still get in if they run around and hit the button over here but as soon as that door starts to open you will see that they are trying to get in and uh, so 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 inside here is where most of the uh, battles take place this is where the main combat happens so as you can tell you do not want to sit here and snipe because as you can see I have no attachment on the gun no scope nothing and I can easily shoot that power box you know with ease and you know if as a person I'd be able to kill him now if we go outside we're just going to jump out this window here sniping could be a possibility if we go through here and uh, run up the stairs here I mean if you really want to you can snipe up here because across on demolition there is a uh, spawn point A for the um, which our team is at spawn point A for demolition don't change but uh, I mean if you're their team you want to camp over here and wait for them to come by you know you could do that but once again no scope at all on the AK and uh, I could still easily get them from across the map here so I mean that's really your choice if you're a hardcore sniper but as you can see a building kind of blocks the way here so uh, it kind of blocks your chances of sniping across on the other side if you're at spawn point A and you're trying to shoot spawn point B because if you saw I saw or I spawned over there which is spawn point B and uh, like I said demolition spawn points do not change now this map it's a uh, it's a very I guess you could say uh, fast pace because once you get inside the uh, main facility over here the, it's just combat there's always somebody inside of there now I really haven't gotten to play this map much because for some reason every time I did the DLC uh, you know um, game type I this map this map was never picked I can't even tell you how many times I played convoy and I hit played convoy a good like seven or eight times played zoo a few times played hotel a few times and then finally got to play this map once right here is spawn point a which i said where the you know who our teams over here spawns now for them you kinda got it seems like a little bit longer of a walk to the center building i don't know if it's just because this building's in the way here but you kinda have to run around that and get over here and uh... I'm going to uh, demonstrate here what not to do. If you see a door closing, don't run under it. As you can see there, it killed me. Um, so that's a big tip there. You may think you barely the dive underneath it, but uh, most of the time you do not make it. Uh, even if it looks like you got it, you don't. Now when you die, it looks like the door kind of stops, but as you can see here, it does not. It continues to go down afterwards, which... Uh, this is a big fort that you want to get held down um, because of those doors. Now, as you can see, there are still other entranceways in here, but the main entranceway is gone. And in a game of demolition, their bomb is right here. 
So this is one of the focus points of this map. This is probably the main focus point of this map. There's a lot of windows for shooting out, of, especially if your team A and team B is spawning right over there. You know, you take them out. But uh, they're also going to be checking that windows because this is the hot spot right here. So, I mean, even though those garage doors um, shut, you can see there are many, many different ways in here still. So, I mean, you if you got the door shut, you still want to keep an eye on the rest of the doorways because, like I see here, there are many ways in. And just kind of listen for the garage doors to open up. Because, like, right here, they could come through here, come through here while you're guarding this garage door, and you'll be dead. Um, this map is not a very good place for claymores. Uh, maybe if you go into a little room over here or something, but as you can see, I mean, you could put one, you know, right here, and uh, there you go. And if somebody comes through there, you know, they're not really going to see it, and most likely they're going to sprint, and it's going to go boom and kill them. So claymores, not they're kind of limited on this map. Um, the doorway here, don't even think about putting a claymore here, because as soon as you start opening it, see it, bam, claymore is gone. Uh, simple as that. So don't try to put a claymore in the doorway. And here's a big tip: if you haven't really seen, it, when the enemy team comes and opens this door, they are going to watch it rise and check for your feet. So if you see the door start coming up, don't just stand here. Get off to the side and wait because they are going to run through. They're not going to open the door and you know run away unless they're trying to flank you and come around the back like where I'm running through here and get you from behind. So I mean if they don't run through in like five seconds, I suggest you check your back because most likely they're coming around to flank you and uh because i've done it before as well is i'll open the door and then as soon as you know i know that that's catching their eye and then i run around the other way and kill them so that's a good way there but uh as far as this map with that focal point being in the center here uh i mean you can kind of get some good across the map shots but it's not very good as you can see here like the farthest I could get is back to that building there which I mean is decent but it's not like a convoy or anything where you can or a hotel if you're upstairs but uh, it's kinda like zoo in a way I guess because there's not many spots where you can get a full map shot like you see here it's not the best because there are buildings there's trucks they did a lot to make sure that you just can't stand there and get across the shot or across the map shops so you know it's a I, I personally like this map I think it's pretty good but I mean I haven't got a lot of time to play on it yet which kind of sucks but uh, so far I'd have to say it's a pretty good map um, my favorite I don't know if this map is my favorite it's definitely not the one I hate the most I personally hate Convoy the most. I don't know if that's just because I've been playing it so many times. Because every time I did the DLC, it was Convoy. So maybe that's why I don't like it. But uh, like I said, Zoo, in my past videos, Zoo's a little too close for me. There's way too many obstacles. I don't care for it too much. I really like Hotel and uh, Stockpile is pretty fun as well. Which is this map right here. And I really like it because of the doors. I just kind of have fun with these. It's fun to watch them go down, and uh, you know, even if you want to try to get them good on the way down, right before it shuts, whip a frag arm there, or you know, tear gas or something, and then uh, what you do is you, or um, not tear gas, but uh, nova gas, and uh, you sit there and wait, and if you see your hit marker go off, that means they're right outside the door, and they're most likely going to be coming through a door here soon, so you gotta wait, so that way you can be ready for them when they start to open a door and your best bet is to not try you know come right in the middle here if you're going to at least here's your best bet is stand back a while and step back here because when the door first starts opening they're not going to be able to see that far yet so that will give you the advantage on the shot like I said the door is shutting see it shutting hurry up whip no okay well that's supposed to go underneath it 
but uh, door is a little too quick for my guy to throw, I guess. But uh, you you get what I'm saying. Throw the Nova gas underneath the door or frag. Same if you're outside the door and you know somebody's in there. Uh, throw that in there before the door opens, so you can uh, you know maybe blind them or weaken their health or even kill them with a frag grenade before you know they get that first shot on you because they're probably sitting here expecting you run through they're not going to expect uh you know grenade to run through but uh yeah guys there's my uh review or my walkthrough and tips on stockpile i hope you guys like the video uh you know give it a thumbs up subscribe and uh this is the last video of my walkthrough series and reviews for the new DLC map pack. I hope you guys enjoyed all of them. Uh, I enjoyed making them. And uh, I'll talk to you guys later. And uh, have a great day.